First up tonight, we're learning more about a 20-year-old man who was shot and killed in Vancouver. This happened last Friday. The Clark County Medical Examiner's Office has now identified him as Josue Lopez Padilla. Fox 12's Drew Marine walks us through what we know and spoke with his friends who say this loss is devastating. Vancouver police say Padilla was found shot here in this parking lot off of Northeast 112th Avenue. His friends say they're heartbroken he's gone, especially with how hard he worked to get his high school diploma this year. Josue Lopez Padilla was always kind to his friends Maria Camacho and Cynthia Lopez. He was a really good guy, really, really good guy. He was always happy, smiling. You would never see him mad or sad. In fact, Maria and Josue dated in high school. Like, he would always be checking up on me. Then, last Friday, Lopez Padilla was shot and killed in northeast Vancouver. This can't be true. Like, it can't be true. And then we just got it confirmed by the family, by his family. Police say they responded to a report of a person shot off of Northeast 112th Avenue just before 8.30. They say a person flagged down an AMR worker saying Lopez Padilla had been shot in the parking lot there. He was taken to the hospital and died. Wednesday, the Clark County Medical Examiner's Office confirmed Lopez Padilla's identity and say he was shot in the pelvis. I, can't, I couldn't believe it. I still can't believe he's... He's gone. Camacho and Lopez say his death is even more heartbreaking because just months ago he got his high school diploma from Skyview High School, something he had been working so hard for. He was like a little bit behind with credits and stuff like that. So he joined this um, program called Leaser at Skyview and he had all the motivation to graduate on time. like. He never stopped. Then Camacho says he was picked up by immigration services in May of 2019 and taken to the Tacoma Northwest Detention Center. It was sad to see that happen because he was so close to graduate with his class. Camacho says he graduated this June and was the second in his family to get his high school diploma. If she could say anything to him now, it's this. I'm so proud of him for everything he did. There is a GoFundMe set up to help his family. You can find that link on our website, kptv.com. In Vancouver, Drew Marine, Box 12, Oregon.